Hello, boys and girls. We are back in another day in Minecraft. Still without mining. Uh, if you want to know more about this uh, challenge, as I call it, check out the intro session uh, to this series. And we are here in our what will become storage and sorting system. Uh, today I will tackle the last wall and uh, as this is a smaller one than the last one we did there, I think I can also tackle a bit of the decoration so that we get an interior for the room and everything is theoretically in working order. And then next episode, we will actually check out if it is in uh, working order and troubleshoot any issues that we find. We also have to set up all the filters. So all that's uh, for the next one. But let me first finish off uh, the uh, uh, main part here for the sorting system and then there to the back of the line of the of the chest and the hoppers there we will have something special because there we will have uh, one stack of chests uh, holding all the items that cannot be sorted and one stack of chests that hold unstackable items and uh, we have the uh, functionality to uh, basically put all these unstackables into shulker boxes so that they don't take up that much space. So uh, let me finish this first part and then come back with the rest. Here on this side now all the uh, chests and uh, filters and uh, whatnot are placed and what's left to do is squeeze in a bit more redstone in this tight gap here between the dropper tower that brings the items up and into the system uh, to basically uh, the chests with uh, unstackables and the uh, shulker box compressor so um, uh, those items don't take up uh, so much space. And then we shall see what we do for decorations. As you can see back there, the last part is now also in place, albeit with some temporary blocks because we are in the process of decorating here the inside. And here the main floor, that's made of black glass because below we will have redstone wiring that I want to see. And here for the entrance we will move the nether portal from down there to up here because basically you might have wondered why are all the farms off the ground well, uh, one thing is we are not allowed to dig anything out and uh, accommodating a building around a farm that's on ground level is a bit difficult. So everything is up in the air, but also this gives us a bit of uh, space below uh, to have some uh, control wiring going around. So while I uh, put this together I have also here a chest uh, with some of the blocks that we will use. Um, we use cyan terracotta here on the, the chest uh, for, the, for the floor outside where we don't have glass. Then on the vertical, 
uh, we will have a gray uh, concrete and because uh, up there above the chest we need stairs I think uh, there we will have something made out of brick and then we will have to figure out how to make this look a bit interesting uh, while at the same time uh, keep the under industrial look. So I would expect that uh, these uh, uh, smooth stones will be swapped out for auto stones. Um, but yeah, let me make a bit more progress and then we can have another look. I think the interior we can call complete. All the walls are done in a combination with uh, gray concrete and uh, stone brick, uh, which is reinforced by this uh, iron gate up there. And initially I had another idea uh, for this to work. Um, with trapdoors, iron trapdoors. Uh, but in order to make that work, because uh, they should be uh, uh, flush to the to the wall, you had to power it. Oh, that should not itself be a problem um, if we uh, uh, put them far uh, enough up so they do not uh, interfere with any of the redstone behind there. But then you have this problem, the corner where you cannot place a trapdoor in the corner. So that would of course look a bit weird. So I decided to go with, uh, with this approach, which does not look that good but not not as bad either then we have some air vents going around and some industrial lighting so i think it all comes together quite nicely and then here in the back we have a small gap that allows us to access the uh, hoppers directly and then on the outside we will eventually have another one that will give us access here to the uh, underside uh, uh, of uh, of the beast and then we will probably also have to uh, have some access to the top side uh, because we need to set up uh, the filters here in the chests uh, actually it's it's not filters it's uh, the categories in in the chest um, so that everything can be sorted and that's definitely something that we will do in the next episode where we will also test this form out this form this sorting system uh, to see where the mistakes are that we made so stay tuned and uh, if you're not already subscribe so you don't miss it and uh, i will see you then goodbye